GoPro 11 Creators Editions. Y'all can't see me, but you can see my POV of my beautiful girlfriend right there. You can see yourself on there while you record. YouTube, welcome back to another video. Just got over to the airport, picking up the uh, rental car right now. Gonna inspect it, make sure it's all right. Let's go ahead and start with the car. But she told me that, so gotta check out which tire it is. Other than that, I would say this is another successful trip done on Turo. So in today's video, I'm gonna be telling y'all some of the reasons why I chose to use my camera setup. If some of you don't know, I use a GoPro 11 Creators Edition. So I'm just gonna be giving y'all some of the reasons why I chose to use the GoPro 11 Creators Edition over other cameras and some of the conveniences it does have to use over a regular camera. It comes with the uh, media mod, so it has a light on top, it has external audio output, and also comes with this stand where you can use as, as a tripod or and it also functions as a battery pack too. So if you're filming a lot, you know you can have that extra battery. Some of you might be thinking about using this camera for daily vlogging. It's to me it's a lot easier to use than any other any other camera because it's a lot more compact. So another good thing about the uh, GoPro is very versatile. It's kind of like an action camera. So you can use it a lot of different things to uh, help you record. So they have like a chest mount, a head mount, a wrist mount, a car mount, all kind of mounts. But right now I'm about to hook up my uh, head mount right here and show y'all like a POV of how it is to uh, record. I'm gonna go ahead and hook up the head mount, give you like a POV of it. Hey Raya, hey. I'm showing them how um, versatile the camera is right now. So as y'all can see, y'all can't see me, but you can see my POV of my beautiful girlfriend right there. Don't look too hard. But y'all y'all see what I'm talking about though. We're just cleaning up the car right now. After this, we're gonna go to the uh, airport and then drop it back off. I got both cars. I got my personal and I got the rental right there. So I got both cars out. So or that BMW. The vet is cool, but I like that BMW. But yeah, just got done at the car wash. Now me and Raya are about to go put gas in the car and then drop it back off at the airport. So later on, we're about to go meet up with uh, Jacob. Uh, we're gonna go get some cool shots of his car. So we just made over to the gas station, just put gas in the car. But uh, as y'all start to deal with more cars, you gotta keep a kit of everything you need. See, I got oil, antifreeze, vacuum cleaner, spray bottle. I got rags, so about to fill up with some air right there. Got a compressor with a PSI reader and everything. One of the cool things about this one is that it just uh, plugs into the car. So we just go check it. I think it's this back one. Well, introduce yourself, right? Cause you weren't on the vlog yet. Hi. <laughs> Oh yeah, you were. You were at the car wash. Okay? I, I yeah. put you on there. Yeah, so this one's reading uh, 32, so I think it's this one. I'm gonna put this one with some air. Right, you too. Just got back to the airport. Got the car parked up right now, and now I'm gonna locate it. Go ahead and lock it up. Gonna go call Mariah and then head on back. As you see, it's that simple. Later on, so one just ended today with her, and then I got one with uh, Carson tomorrow. And uh, let me send Mariah my location so I can send it to my guests. Makes it a lot easier for the guests to find the car. So another reason why I like the GoPro, cause it's a lot easier, you know? It's not a big camera that I'm holding around, walking with, you know? Getting used to recording and vlogging in public. It's literally the size of my hand, but it also picks up a wide view and angle. It's flexible, it works with me, and I work with it, you feel me? So now, we're finna call Mariah. Hey baby, um, I just got done with the car, so if you could okay. please come get me. About to put this in my pocket and just continue on. I like the GoPro because it's small and compact. Right, yeah, I think that's one of the big reasons why I like it too. And it's honestly. easy to use and it's like half the price of a basic camera, but it everything plus more. You can't put a big old camera on a head mount. Exactly. I mean, exactly. you can carry around a tripod, but you can't do a POV of what you are doing like this. You can't do that with a regular yeah. basic camera 
the size of my phone. We paid, um, cause me and Ryan went half on it. This was like a gift for both of us for when we went to Disney. That way we could both have these uh, memories. So we spent like a thousand something dollars for this, but it came with all that. And it's, to me, it's more versatile. Like this little camera, you see how wide it is, but you should see how far away she has it too. And it can even be even wider than that. My arm too. isn't even stretched out all the way. Exactly, but you can see both of us in the frame. So you can see yourself on there while you record. So there's a screen on the back of it and on the front. So it makes it really versatile so you can vlog and see what you have in frame and in shot too. Um, it shoots in 4K, um, 1080p, and all kind of different uh, volumes of footage, whatever you need to film in. It can shoot it. It has slow motion. It has stabilization, like with your shooting, like going on like a bike ride. Look at that deer. Show the deer. They Very. did their thing with the Creator Edition. Yeah, they did. Honestly, they did a, a very good job. It's the Canon PowerShot V10. It has like a whole little built-in little stand and has the thing that you can flip the thing up and it has the camera on it. So maybe you can maybe upgrade to this. I am kind of thinking about upgrading my camera for sort of like when I do like sit down videos and everything. But if I'm on the go, if we're traveling, I'm always gonna reach for the GoPro, honestly. Kind of like with my drone. And it's look how easily it folds up and just tucks away. Like even Raya said when she picked it up, she was like, my phone's heavier than this. And that drone is capable of doing so much. I like just the portability and the compactness of devices. I don't know, like if, if I'm gonna reach for or use it every day, I want it to be something that's like easy and simple to use. And so I'll get back to y'all once we uh, meet up with uh, Jacob. Like I said, we're gonna get some cool rolling shots of his car. The man, the myth, the legend. My dog Jacob pulling up in the low rider. <laughs> Please. My dog got the the gold BBSs on that mug. You see that? My dog got the gold BBSs. What's going on, Jacob? What's going on? This is my dog, Jacob, if y'all don't know. Little Say what's place. up to Jacob, you know, you know, welcome to the channel, right in the car. And my dog, you know, putting the hard work, got himself a nice, clean truck, too. It's not low enough yet, bro. I it, think it's low enough. No, it's nowhere near low enough. For real? He not used to be on the camera and everything. We'll get the official uh, review of the truck later in another vlog. Yeah, so right now we're gonna get some roller shots, the sun setting. We're gonna go on the bridge, get some cool shots of it and everything like that. I got my car, Raya's in the car. Um, she's either gonna take the pictures or uh, drive, either one. Here's a good shot with low light and no editing done to the footage. It's almost dusk and you can still see that it's still a good picture and clear. It started to rain on the bridge, but luckily the GoPro is water resistant and it can handle a certain amount of water and you don't have to worry about your camera breaking or getting water damaged. So another good shot of the truck on the bridge. Overall, it came out really well. Another reason why I love using the GoPro. Sounds dry. It's not the best in low light, but it still looks cool. Like you can still see, I can even turn the flashlight. On it too. Look at right, look at the shooter right there. It looks cool with the rain too, don't it? It does, honestly. All right, you too. So I got the flashlight on. Right now it's a little dark. Well, hold on, let me go over here. You can probably see me better in this light. I'm gonna go ahead and end out the video. But that's another reason why I like using the GoPro because it's nice and versatile. As you saw, I just got those clips in the rain. All that was shot in the rain off this camera here. It's water resistant, it's an action camera. So you can do a lot with it. So if you enjoyed today's video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And thanks for watching. Peace.
Sounds driving.